What's up YouTube? So I've just parked up at Burrator and I'm now on my way up on the trail heading up to Downtour. Yeah. And with me is Naomi. So she's my sister and uh, been meaning to get out on a hike with her for a while. So thought why not take her up on this one? It was a spare of the moment decision to come out on a hike. Um, so why not? It's a lovely day for it too. So that up there is down tour and that's where we're going to be going today. Just need to find a way of getting up to it because I don't actually know a way of getting up now, if I'm honest. No, I'm not joking. <laughs> oh, I think there's a way you can duck down over that way, to be fair, but... Yeah, there'll be a footpath. Well, there won't be a footpath. Oh, this is a footpath. Yeah, but it's not going to stay like this. So I'm just trying to look for a, a cut through up to the tour. I can see people down there and it is a sort of a grassy path. So I think we're going to try to go this way. Pardon? I think it says footpath. Why does it say footpath? Oh. I don't know why. I said dress appropriately. And she's wearing trainers. It's a leaf. Yeah. I said dress appropriately and um, she's put trainers on and bright pink top and shorts. So not dressed appropriately for the moors. No. Alright, so I think we're gonna turn back and go the way I thought we should have gone up first, which is down that way, follow the, the path past the, the woodlands area over there, just because this side is completely covered in, uh, in foliage. So don't want to be traipsing through that. And Naomi is getting a bit worried about adders. Today is also the opportunity for me to break in my new boots. So quite looking forward to see how they perform. And these boots are the Regatta Endeavour boots. Picked them up from Traigle Mills. And for you that don't know what Traigle Mills is, it's a sort of, a, what would I say? What do you call it? A, a wholesale place. Um, we've got one here in Devon and Newton Abbott, um, and there's one in Cornwall at Liscard. Good place for some bargains. Oh, I'll tell you what, I'm building up a bit of a sweat. Can we go back? No, we cannot go back. It's literally just there. Just there. That's where we're going now, mate. Just need to find a way of cutting into it. All right, we're coming to the end of the woodland bit, and just got to keep an eye out for a way to pass down that way so yeah I think what we'll do is we'll walk up that way a little bit more cut down through the field and then uh, straight up nice gradual climb my head is stopping <laughs> yeah you're in the you're in the army cadets now. Why are you struggling to do this? It's so hard. How is it? Because I'm not in the army cadets, so don't put my jacket on. What? <laughs> I don't... You are in the army cadets, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. Because then I like do walks like this. Oh right. I didn't 
voluntarily do it. Well, you kind of do if you if you keep going to the cadets, then you do voluntary do it, don't you? And you do it in full full on combat gear as well. Yeah, but it's just hard. I think it's harder doing it in full on military clothing. But you know, that's just my opinion. Battle PT. What? This is what we do, battle PT. What's battle what's battle PT? Well you do the military course in full kit. Oh right. Fair enough then. I'm back. Oh, she's moaning that she wants to go back to the car. We're not even at the top of the tour yet. We're not even at the tour. Oh, city folk, eh? They just don't get it. So I've just come across what looks to be like some sort of uh, old stone structure. So I thought I'd uh, give that one a little explore, see what that's about, shall we? I mean, it's just a pile of old stones, but like a um, sort of hut circle. No, it's not even a hut circle, but some sort of boundary markers. And there looks to be a uh, sort of archway there. Just in there, so I'm assuming this could have been a hut of some sort. Anyway, Time to get up on top of down tour. If Naomi stops moaning. She's moaning about getting to here and it's been a slight incline. And now we've got to climb up that and I don't think she knows how steep that's gonna actually be. So yeah, that'll be fun. Just hearing the moaning. Right, let's get to it. All right. The next question is, how do we get down here? I found a little path to get down to the bottom. Then got a slight little stream to cross. Should be fine. So, the first proper test of these boots, crossing that small stream. It wasn't really passable without getting your feet in the stream. These boots did not let a single bit of water in, so pretty happy with that. And as you can probably see, a little pink dot over there, that's Naomi, she doesn't want to carry on anymore. So I'm going without her. She's just going to sit there and chill. Lazy sod. Just to the right of me over there is Sharper Tour and Leather Tour, two of my favourite tours on Dartmoor. Just because of uh, the simple fact of looking down on the reservoir when you're up there and they're super easy to get to. So that's always a bonus. Here we are, nearly at the top of Down Tour. It's a little bit of a steep climb, not going to lie. But I'm looking forward to getting to the top and having a look at the views. Try not to spoil it too much by looking around as I'm climbing. But here we are.
what an amazing view this is. So from here, you can see, I think that's Coombs Head Tor behind me there. And I think right in the distance is higher Hartor, maybe. Um, then you've got the, uh, and then you've got Gutter Tor with Eastern Tor, etc. on that side. Um, and then obviously the infamous Sheep's Tor just there. Look, overlooking Borough Tor Reservoir, looking beautiful. And then, as I said before, you've got Leather Tor and Sharper Tor in the distance there. And then over that way is an area we should all be familiar with if you are subscribed to the channel. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, maybe now is a good time to hit that button. So over there, I can see Great Miss. I can see um, Great Staple and Mid Staple. I can see Ingra Tor over there. Um, yeah. There's a tour over there. Cannot remember what it's called, but that is a tour I want to do. Cannot remember. And then obviously you've got the Princetown Mast right in the back there. And you've got all this vastness just over there. I don't know if you can see it on here, but just there is Naomi. I'll tell you what, she is missing out on these views. These are amazing. So I think I'm just going to sit here for a while and uh, take in the views, definitely. So good out here. Dartmoor is absolutely beautiful. And I love Burrator Reservoir. I mean, it's such a nice place to look on, especially when, well, you're here now. This is a good spot to be. Leather Tour and Sharp Tour are also both really nice to sit on top of and just look out onto the reservoir. And you can see uh, quite a lot of Plymouth from the, that side as well. I mean, Sheep's Tour over there on the left, that's, uh, that's another nice place to be. It's so high up you can see for miles. So yeah, it's worth the climb on that one. If you have the opportunity to come and visit Dartmoor for a weekend holiday or something, then definitely, definitely do it because on a nice day like today, you won't be let down at all. Well, that's it for the video. I hope you've enjoyed it. And if you have, please consider subscribing to the channel for more hiking, world camping and gear reviews. So hopefully I will see you all next time. See you later.